NBA, have some of these guys come to you for advice to help them, you know, increase their games to make them become better players suited for the NBA? Uh, the guys on the team? Yes. Absolutely, absolutely. I'm talking to the guys ongoing every day. If it ain't Bello, you know, if it ain't uh, it's Bello, Trent, uh, Kofi, um, Austin, Jake, all of these guys want to get better. All of these guys strive to get better. And I think that's one of the things that the culture builds like is never satisfied. Like Brad is never satisfied. And and the taste that those guys had in their mouth, and we're beginning to feel it, especially new guys on the staff. Just after that Loyola game, we'll, we'll never forget that. He'll never let us forget that. And I think these guys are, are have admiration, but I think one of the bigger things they do, they live in the moment too. They're, they're, they're at Illinois at the university and they're doing, they're going to do their part here to make sure we're successful. And then ultimately that's the goal. But that's one thing I think Brad does. It. Another thing he does really well is make these guys live in the moment. You, a lot of people just, when you got hired, they thought this was a guy who could just train. But obviously Coach Underwood talked about how great of a coach you are. What do you, for the fans who are going to watch this, what do you bring to the table, not just as a trainer, but as a coach? I think one of the biggest things I, I bring is relationships, you know, helping manage players. Uh, you know, guys, you know, tend to trust me because of the, the amount of time we spend together off the court. Um, just being really, really detailed with small stuff. Uh, and, you know, these guys have game, you know, just making sure they're doing little things like following through, you know, getting to where they're supposed to be, doing what they're supposed to be, when they're supposed to be doing it. Um, just helping those guys be really, really detailed. So one of the things I, you know, one of my, my one of my, um, you know, responsibilities is helping out with the defense and then over the player development piece and the film piece. So just just doing that and just trying to do my part and, you know, be be one of the stronger parts on the link, just like everybody else that must be successful. How detailed about coaches, Coach Underwood? Very, very detailed. He want things to how you setting screens, to how you coming out of screens, to how you closing out, to how you're to how you're in the help. He's really, really detailed and that's um something that I've learned about him, how he handle business. He's really, really detailed on the court and I've learned that and that's 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 helped me a lot tremendously. Thank you, Tim. Thanks. Coach, uh, I wanted to ask you about recruiting. That's what we do at Rivals. But um, uh, Back in the day here, they had Jimmy Collins brought in kids from Chicago. Mm -hmm. Chin was here with Chicago Connections. How important is this city to this program and, and how, how are you going to use your connections to, to bring in some of the top players? Well, absolutely. You know, having Chicago here and, 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 you know, this being a state school is tremendous. And I think people know that. And um, the last few years, they've had success and we're building on that momentum. I think we'll have a really, really good year this year, really make a really deep run. Uh, we have a goal. Uh, and, and internally, we're trying to do some things. But, of course, Chicago is big. You know, a lot of people try to get inside of Chicago, but I think with the relationships that we have and I have, we'll be able to get there. And then we just got to get the right kids, too. You know, every kid, just because they're rated in a certain place or ranked in a certain place, may not might not fit our culture, might not be, you know, the best fit for what we're doing. So I think that's one of the bigger things. And when you, when you start bringing those guys here, just making sure it fits what we're trying to do. Well, what kind of feedback are you getting from the high school coaches around this state and in, in Chicago in particular? I think it's been, I think it's been um, pretty positive. You know, me and Jeff do a lot. Chester got some relationships here as well. Me, me and Jeff kind of, you know, go up and down the state. You know, Jeff got really, really strong ties. Um, I know all the guys in the public league, most of the guys in the surrounding Chicago land area, um, northwest suburbs, south suburbs, et cetera. So I think it's been, I think it's been positive. I think that they, they're excited to have one of their own. You know, I'm a CPS graduate. Uh, coach CPS um, and I'm still around them. I've never really left the community so I've always been integral so just to have one of their own there is really really exciting.